Hello, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a kitting down. I'm going to be kitting down two diamond paintings. Um, so these are diamond paintings that my mom had done. And um, one of them is here and then one of them is this one. And then I'm going to combine these two and then I'll have at least an empty container. So if you've been following my channel a while, I kitted up a lot of diamond paintings for my mom. And then she kind of stopped diamond painting, period. <laughs> like cold turkey, like no more by diamond painting. So I got them back from my mom because my mom went back to the Philippines. So these are the last two that I haven't kitted down mainly because she hasn't done the companion um, diamond painting. So like one, it says it's 413 butterfly finish, 44 2022. So, Let's see. This is everything my mom finished. My, my, by the time my mom stopped diamond painting, she did 107 diamond paintings. So if she finished this 4-4... Four, four. I didn't take a picture of all of her finishes, but if she finished this one 4-4... Four, four, it, this, it's this one, 4-13. So at some point she had done this diamond painting. And then this one says done 620 and it's sunflowers. Oh, it's this one. So at some point my mom had done this one. Let me tell you, when she finished this one, she was so unhappy because she couldn't, like, you, the finish of it, you couldn't read any of the writing. So she was like, unreadable writing on vase, tried to redo. And yeah, she was so unhappy. <laughs> She was like, I don't like it. I cannot read it. <laughs> but I thought that was kind of funny. So, so I'm going to be kidding down two. Hopefully, I'm going to take out the ones so that I don't accidentally kit down. Well, I think it'll be obvious. Well, I'm going to take them out so that I don't accidentally kit down the ones that are... much of this there is but apparently there was a second container so I was I'm like there's really that much okay so, so what I did to differentiate them is I had put in like so this one I put in a pink highlighter so these are the ones with the pink highlighter and then the ones with no pink highlighter they're not done yet so the one done, hey, at least the one that's not done is the one with the pink highlighter, so. Yep. So that's not, okay, I'm gonna use masking tape for the new label. So this one's going to be, Where's my pen? 260. It says flower and butterfly. <laughs> 260 flower butterfly. And that's the one with the pink. I don't have my pink highlighter anymore. Well, at least I can't find the pink highlighter, so I'm just going to put that in. So that I know that's that one. Okay. So let's move. So the green one is done, okay. Just making sure that one's just done. So moving the pink. these two still need to 
Dawn. And then I also had sent my mom off with like the rest of the stuff that was um, kitted up already. Apparently my, 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 my mom was like, I'll find someone to give it to or something. So. I'm just gonna put it back in here just so that it's not, the containers are not all over the place. So if you haven't seen my kidding downs before, I do have, um, so this is me putting away my leftover diamond painting drills from finished diamond paintings. So I have like a card here that I use, that, this is just laminated card stock that I, and then I used my silhouette cutter to cut them into the, cut them. And then, um, and then I, these labels here that's on there. I do have the templates to print them on my shared diamond painting stuff. I forgot what I call it anymore. Um, linked below, so feel free to use it. Um, and then I have a bag for every um, DMC color. So like when you get a diamond painting, they often have, you know, the legend and then there's like a um, a symbol and then a number there and then usually there's like another number there that's just like one two three four five and then a symbol and then a number and then this number is the DMC number and then e each the DMC numbers should be consistent diamond painting to diamond painting so and I say should because there's been times where they are not consistent so yeah and then there's certain colors like 310 that I have tons of that I actually have so I have three of these boxes to put all the colors but I also have this messier box this is everything that I have way 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 too many of and then they're just kind of in these other bags because if I were to keep my three tens in this con in this situation here do you see it'll take up a whole column this is all three ten three ten three ten three ten 310. So I feel like now I need another bag of 310 because this bag is very full. So might as well empty out this bag here. And then I always like to keep a little bit in the container to compare shades with because I've noticed that not all not all um, diamond paintings are um, not all DMCs have the same shade they kind of have slightly different variations and maybe you'll see it at some point in this video where there's more than one shade for something. And some people like to kit this down, kit down like in DMC order and then just um, have one box out at a time. I don't. I. I have them all out at the same time and then I just jump um, to wherever I need to go because I don't know I don't I don't like taking the time to put things in DMC order so you know how I was saying that sometimes there's more than one shade here is an example I'm not sure how obvious it will be but because sometimes the camera doesn't take it so like this is a more this one's like a more golden yellow this is more pale yellow and this one kind of looks more like a I don't know um, it's 
I don't know, a straw like yellow. <laughs> so which one is this one? I feel like it's none of the above. If it looks like anything, it looks like this one. No. like having more than three different shades for a DMC so I do have this here um, a viewer sent it to me and so it has like all the DMC's and then like by like, color coding and this is how I kick down things that are not with no DMC's so I'm gonna see if I could find a match for something in here It looks like 743 or 744. Let's see. I can't find I have an I have more. Like it does look like this one. Yep. Okay, went to look for or get another ruler so that it makes it easier for me to put things away. See, now I'm thinking since there's so little of this 3822, I should find the match for this one. Seven, maybe. I think that's what I'm going to be doing. If there's more than two, two um, shades, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go look for matches in a different DMC. Okay. Because I don't want to have like that many bags. Okay, three seven five zero. And no, this is not a requirement to diamond paint, to do this after you finish diamond painting. This is just something I, I like to do. Because I have used these, I have used my leftover drills to diamond paint um, cross stitch conversions. And I have also started um, 
mixing the closer shades together where before I would be like, okay, this 938, this looks a lot different. Okay. So sometimes I think, I swear, like budget companies just use um, a closer shade so that they don't have to... Looks like 898 to me. Um, you know, if they run out of one, they just find a similar one. Yeah, it looks like 898. Well, at least this one of 898. Yeah, I do think sometimes the diamond painting companies will just find a close enough shade. Wow, this looks really different. more like 722 than this one. Oh yeah, it's, I think it's 721. Oh, <laughs> that was a bad match. I don't know if you can tell. Oh well. Mm. Oh well, it was probably 722. Should always go with my gut. Maybe I need more light. <laughs> I keep forgetting to put the ruler. I need more light. not matching. Did my mom put them in the wrong place? <laughs> I, I can see my mom doing that too. Um, because she, she, when she diamond paints, she diamond paints where she has like all the colors around her on trays and whether she puts them back in the right containers. That's a different thing. This one looks like 597. I separated these two. Oh my gosh, I'm horrible. It should have been the dark brown. Mm. 
At this point, I feel like I might as well just combine them all. It's brown, right? What part of any diamond painting is this going to be in? I think since I've been using these for cross-stitch conversions, I've noticed that the, sl the darker colors, the slight colored variation doesn't matter as much. I notice when I have the light on, it makes the color on the video not great. Four fifty one. like it matches okay it's okay enough three eight six one but yeah ever since I've been using these for my cross stitch conversions where I used to be like no I can't mix two two shades now I'm like that's eh, okay but these you could tell it's very different right I feel like this is lighter You know, I have like this empty bag where I I use it to to compare how it looks behind the bag, but I can't find it right now. Seven ninety nine. Okay, I'm not sure if you can tell the how different these look. No, I don't know. They do look different in person. This one looks like this one. Let's see, I have equal amount of both of them, so 841. So which one is the correct one? I don't know. Okay. After those first couple ones where I'm like, why don't they match? Is this going to be the whole video? Is me going to try to match? <laughs> wow. I don't know if you can see how different that one looks. So it's because I talked about the whole how the beginning of the video I think this is 3826. That doesn't look like 3826.
But it's a much closer match than that. I'm not going to put it in 780. I'm just going to put it into a second bag of 3826. DMC labels. Here. Eight, two, six. Since it's like the one with the least amount of the shade, I'm hoping it's something else, but nothing is. Maybe 642. which I don't have any so I can't but you know it looks more like it doesn't look like any of these Let's just make it 3032. And I don't have any 3032. <laughs> but yeah, I'm trying to two bags or less. Two bag two shades or less. No, no more than that. I'm trying to do that. Nine five nine. Seven six six. Oh, my God. 
gosh, it's hard to see. It does look more like the one with less. Yep. See, this is why I sometimes keep two shades because I swear. that um, sometimes there's just two predominant versions of the same of the same DMC so and you know you could also mix all the shades together if you don't care I'm not at that point Ooh, there's no 613 so, I, I guess I never had 613 because the bag's not open. Three seven eight seven. <clears throat> it does not look like it. Yeah, it looks different. Might not look different on camera, but in person it looks different. Let's have the label for it three seven. What am I on? Three seven eight seven. Is there another bag in there? No. Okay. I don't know why I don't have it. I must have used it for something else. I, I have another. Copy. I wonder if I have an AB of it. That could be it. So this one, I have like three predominant shades for this, so I don't know if I'm, even though I'm like, I don't want to have more than one shade. There's still a drill in there. Oh wait, I have it. I started taping the tops of the lid of the um, Tic Tac containers, mainly because they keep falling off sometimes. So I forgot I hadn't done it yet. See, they, they come off. But yeah, I have three different shades, so that have a lot. Or maybe, do I think I could find them? Well, the most different one is actually this one.
maybe 754 that we're gonna find Three seven seven one was my next. Oh no, that one's much darker. Okay, I don't find I don't have any. I don't have any better match. Okay, trying three eight six zero. any other shades so this is just gonna be another shade no like they're the same I was like looking I was like I don't know it looks the same after I poured it into the bag yep One's a more like grayish version and one's a more beige, beige version. Three, seven, six, one. Okay, this one does look different. Look the same either. Yeah, no.
3765. Looks like this one. Do you believe 939 I think is one of the ones I actually don't have, I don't think I have that much in my squares. I have a lot in my rounds, but <laughs> squares. Because I, I, I think I was trying to kit some, kit something up or for one of my cross stitch conversions and I actually didn't have that much of it. But that's okay. You could probably substitute it with 310 which is black with no problems because and black is not one of the ones that I don't have much of this one but this one has three shades so I'm gonna see if I can bring it down to two okay this of all of these this is the most different so I think I want to find that one looks like seven five eight Oh, I have a problem with 758. Look at how many shades of 758 I have. But I think it does look like this one. I think this one is close enough that I don't know why I have it separated. And that one is just so different. Okay, let's try to see if I can find this one. Seven. We'll put four hundred two away. Yeah, no, not four hundred seven. Well, I don't know what the seven five eight is. So. It'll just have to be a third shade.
Yeah, the lighting kind of sucks. Sorry. Well, at least the lighting looks like it kind of. It's because I when I have my other light on, the lighting doesn't look as good. But that's my desk lamp. For when I need to look closer. Okay, it looks like this one. But I think I'm going to actually overflow on that. So I'm gonna... put this into my overflow. I like to keep some drills in there for comparison purposes. Where's my label? Fell on the floor. What number am I on? 677. And then I like putting in a sticker to tell myself that, yes, there is more in my overflow. So that's what this sticker is for. I just got these from the Dollar Tree. Um, so I'm like, yes, go look for more if I need more. Six, seven, seven. I guess that just goes behind 666 and so yeah if you've seen a couple of my bags with the happy face sticker that just means this is not all I have there's more in my overflow box if this thing here there's more my overflow box is getting kind of overflowing I don't see why I have these separated. Okay, I kind of see now that I have light why I have them separated. <laughs> All right. Well, there's still only two shades of that one, so until it becomes a third, they're gonna stay together. I mean, they're gonna stay separate. Three, three, six, four. Okay, this one has three. And not much. There's not enough of a difference. That one's much lighter. So that one's probably something else. Man, some of my labels, they look the same, but they're not because they're not removable. But oh well. Like the labels that come with storage, I have no idea whether they're removable or not. 
3770 and I just gamble. Is it removable? Is it not removable? Okay. Yeah, that's the same. I actually have a lot of this. This is like the common skin tone color in uh, diamond paintings. Seven seven zero. I guess if there were people, I don't diamond paint that many people diamond paintings. Even though I feel like it's popular, like sometimes I'm like, I see all these people diamond paintings, and I'm like, I don't know, I don't know why anyone would want to diamond paint these, but obviously people do. Not that I haven't. I have diamond painted. The people diamond paintings before. Three ten. Did just empty this out. I think I need to find like a predominantly black diamond painting or something so that I could use up my three tens. Maybe I look for a black and white diamond painting. Do I wonder if I have enough? Um, a black and white cross stitch pattern to I think yeah that's okay. So I can use up all my black. One sixty nine. Okay, one's more gray and one's. I feel like this matches none of them. Yeah. You know what's funny when I'm comparing it to here? My match is 169. Unless it's I guess it kind of looks like this one. If I was gonna go for which one's closer. Okay, it does actually look the same. Now that I pour a couple in there. Okay. did get another heaven earth cross stitch pattern when they were doing a 50% off sale. It's a small one. It should only be about like I think 40 by 50 when it's finished. Um, and then I've been contemplating, I haven't kitted it up yet. I've been contemplating whether to do it in squares or rounds. Um, I think, but I don't want to buy anything for it. So I think I probably am more likely to be able to have enough if I did it in squares than in rounds but I already have several square 
cross stitch conversions already kitted up so I thought I should do another round but I do know there's a lot of colors in the rounds I don't have much of at least when I was doing my cat um, cross stitch conversion I there were several that I didn't have much of but the cat picture also has a completely different color scheme than the picture I just bought so maybe it might be a might be fine because it's a different color scheme or I could do what I did with the cat picture which was <laughs> just kit it up and then dot and paint and then if I ran out of color I would find a close one and people said they couldn't tell <laughs> when I said that at some point I started running out of colors uh, out of the DMC and then I substituted it um, with a closer match and people said in the final picture they couldn't tell but I was yeah it was kind of it was kind of nerve-wracking though because I kept I kept running especially when I was almost done I kept running out of a color and then I'd have to go find one but then I wouldn't look for it until I actually ran out because I didn't know what I would need until I ran out of it so so I would be diamond painting and then suddenly I'm like I have to stop I have to go look for another dumb another color and then I have to go look for another color I think there were some DMC colors I ended up using like three or four different DMC's to substitute because I would run out of the substitute and then I'd run out of the second substitute yeah it was it was kind of nerve-wracking to do but in the end I don't think there was it wasn't that obvious that I had a whole bunch of color substitutions And then the other, the one that I just got is a smaller diamond painting. Okay. It looks more like that. I'm, I'm going to try to find the, this one is different from both of them. It's the most different from both of them. So I think I'm going to see if this looks like any of the other things in my chart. I probably tried before and I couldn't find it. Okay, if I were gonna try anything, even though it doesn't look that similar, I try 165. No. Yeah, it doesn't look like anything. At least on this chart. Okay, it's just going back to 3819 then. 10 of <laughs> that was not the best match oh well Eight hundred. 
shades of this one. I don't know, all of them look kind of different from each other. <laughs> so, which one is the, the bad cousin? I'm gonna go for this one, just because I think it looks the most different from everything else. But it looks like nothing else. At least on here, hey, maybe. Maybe this one could be the bad cousin. like nothing else. So maybe I should go for the three shades <laughs> instead of just two. 608. Seven, six, eight. Wait, why am I looking all the way there? Three, seven, six, five. Okay, it doesn't want to come out. Okay, whatever. All right, so finally finished. This one actually took me longer than I thought it would, but hey. A lot of you guys like the longer videos and are disappointed when my videos are too short. Okay, so there is that one kitted down. So that's all I have for today. So thank you very much for watching and happy diamond painting. Bye!